The city has changed. The developers are winning. I'm not sure there is anything anyone can do anymore. The sick city is spreading its cheap development all over the countryside. And for the entire population, ignorance is bliss in the inside walls of their apartment. The realities of what we're doing to our planet is conveniently insignificant. It is nearly too late, and the small number of us that are left who care are reducing our numbers. It seems every day another activist is pronounced missing or dead. Our last glimmers of hope are disappearing fast. Will they come for me next? Dear Mr. Raymond, we've been made aware of your current involvement in environmental and socialist activities. The accusations against you are of a very serious nature. Mr. Raymond, as I'm sure you're aware, our world is falling to pieces. The world humanity is creating for itself is getting to a point beyond saving. I'm sad to say our cause is finished. Humanity no longer needs to be saved because it doesn't want to be saved. If they want us gone, then let's leave. I know of a place, friend, an island, where everything is different. The island is filled with sounds and smells once common in this city. Waves crash, birds sing, trees rustle in the breeze. Sounds that can only be remembered as part of a world that is in our past. Great forests remain standing, ancient trees towering where skyscrapers now stand. An environment that is diverse and full of life. The views are beautiful and forever changing, unlike the rigid, concrete framework of this city. Urban environments are nestled in amongst the surrounding nature. People live in friendly communities and work alongside one another to live in harmony with the environment and with each other. We have reserved a place for a select few people. We would like to offer you one of these positions. Join us and lead your life the way you've always dreamed of. Leave this world behind and be who you are born to be. A train is leaving for the island from the downtown train station, Platform 1. Be there tonight at 11.30pm if you're interested.
We've been trying to catch you for a long time, Mr. Raymond. Who are you? Activists like you are a dying breed. Soon you'll all be gone and we'll be able to give the people of this city everything they deserve. Don't you see, Mr. Raymond? This world doesn't need to be saved because it doesn't want to be saved. You bitch. This is all a setup. Well done, Mr. Raymond. Ah, ah, ah. You should have known the island was too good to be true. Doesn't have to be. We can fix it. Then why would we want to do that? Don't you see all the damage it does? Okay, perhaps you're right. But I don't think you understand the billions of dollars I earn doing this. Goodbye, Mr. Raymond. What has this city become? People wonder why everyone is afraid to express themselves. In a world where soulless developers run rampant like gang leaders in the night, raping the city of anyone who expresses alternative ideals or spreads any message of hope. Why is the idea of the island so ridiculous? Things didn't used to be so far from that. I don't know what changed. I just remember one day people shut up. The day freedom of speech became extinct. From there it all started to change.